Hi guys, in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to increase or boost your FPS in Apex Legends on any PC or laptop. So basically I'm going to try and make this an easy and a quick tutorial and all you want to do is open the game and go to the video tab. And now once you're here you want to set the game on full screen. So set it on full screen because windowed and uh, borderless window may cause some FPS drops, etc. Set the aspect ratio, make sure it is native. Set the resolution to native. So if you have a full HD screen, then set it to full HD or just set it to any of these settings. But just make sure it's native. And basically that's all for these five options. Now go to advanced and basically what you want to do is just disable vsync and this should add a lot of fps that you aren't getting. Put anti-aliasing to TCAA so try maybe try and disable it but wait for, uh, wait for the end of this tutorial and after that just disable it and see if it gets you any more fps if it doesn't then just leave it to T TSAA. Next, just choose the texture trimming budget. So maybe put it at like very low or very low or low. I think low is enough. If you have like 8 gigabytes of RAM, then 2 to 3. A gigabytes of VRAM is okay. If you have an older uh, graphics card, then this should be okay. Next, put texture filtering uh, to three linear or bilinear. So either low or very low. Just make sure that texture streaming budget and texture filtering uh, just. Uh, are one lower than each other so if this is uh, too low set this to 3 linear on very low set it to low on none set it to bilinear so I think that uh, setting texture streaming budget to low is okay and setting texture filtering to bilinear is also okay now go to ambient occlusion uh, deep quality and you can not just disable it just leave it disabled. Set sun shadow coverage and spot shadow uh, and sun shadow detail to low. Set both of them to low. Set spot shadow detail to disabled or low. I'm gonna put it at disabled. The next thing is volumetric lightning. So you can disable this you can also disable dynamic spot shadows disable them both also click on set model detail effects detail impact marks to low and the next thing you want to do is just set ragdolls to low now just apply the settings to the game and see if you get any more FPS. If you have, uh, if you get uh, more FPS than uh, what you already ha had, uh, I would recommend uh, going back to the settings to video and just basically maybe playing uh, playing a little bit with these settings, maybe setting model detail to medium and effects detail to medium. This this will just make your game look a little bit better. That may help you get that win. Uh, but basically won't add uh, many FPS than you already have. And that's it. Just click on apply. And start your game. The next step what you want to do is just open this PC. Go to local disk C. Go to users. Go to PC. Go to saved games, 
click on respawn click on apex and click on local now what you want to do here is just open video config so right click on it click on open with and select notepad and what you want to do here is just mess up with mess a little bit with the settings but before you do that just make sure that you have a backup of the file so just copy the file before you make any changes and paste it on your desktop and save it there in case there is a problem with the game so you can uh, you can have a backup of it and just replace it now what you want to do is just maybe uh, lower the number of ragdoll max, max count set uh, deep depth feather enable to zero and the next thing what you want to do is just uh, mess uh, just lower uh, dec our decals and basically that's it just make sure that when you're lowering decals you divide by two so 256 divided by two and set it here and uh, basically that applies to all of the settings in here just remember to divide by two and mess a little bit with the settings see what works for you and save it click on file save and exit the folder now what you want to do is just restart the game and basically that's it thanks for watching please subscribe like and comment tell me if this video if this tutorial worked for you if it helped you etc thanks for watching again and bye